if you set something in a scene, that's the way it is. It's the rule. And so the scene's over, it happens. You can't go up to somebody and say, it's like, say, some two people in a scene, somebody says, look at that bird. The next person says, that's not a bird, that's a, a flying a unicorn. No, it, it can't be, because it's a bird. It's not a bird, it could be a type of bird. You know, it could be uh, an uh, Oriole, it could be, uh, you know, the more specific you get, the better Oh my god, it's huge! Yes, it could be, it could be a giant rock. No, it's not a but big! Yes. But once you say something, that's the way it is in the scene. And you want to, uh, uh, agreeing tends to make a scene go farther. They, they have a, uh, a game uh, they do in Second City Training Classes where they do, uh, they tell you to uh, do nothing but uh, say, uh, disagree with the person in the scene. And you'll see how far you get. It's really, really hard to make anything interesting happen in the scene when you're constantly disagreeing with the other person. So you want to accept it, uh, accept what the person is saying, and then heighten it. Yes, and add something to it. Because uh, when you start out on the scene, you're in a blank world. You're in a gray, nebulous, uh, that's not a word, but you know, you're, in, you're nowhere. And everything you add to the scene adds more color, adds bright. You're building your own world. You're two gods. And everything you say is real. So you want to uh, accept and heighten, yes, and, and you want to avoid the questions. Have you ever seen uh, uh, Whose Line Is It Anyway? Yeah. <laughs> Has anyone seen Who's, Whose Line Is It Anyway? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, they do a game of questions only. And you really watch the actors struggle trying to come up with more questions and not actually say something. It's really hard to do a scene when you're just asking questions over and over again. And it's really kind of, uh, you're really putting the onus on your scene part. You're saying, you're saying, uh, I don't know where we are. Here, you tell me what we're doing. So if you ask questions, you're really putting the, the pressure on the other person. Uh, and what you want to do in a scene is you want to make a choice. It's very easy when you're in this gray world is to just let it be. But you have to design it yourself. So you have to make a bold, interesting choice, uh, whether it, it's an action that you're doing, whether it's who you are, uh, whether it's uh, your attitude or, or an emotion you want to cling to, and you want to stick with it because people don't change. Certainly not within the course of a three-minute scene. You know, uh, if you are decide that you are a crotchety old man, stick with the crotchety old man. Don't suddenly become a you know a, a loving grandfather type like by the end of the scene because it just it just doesn't happen. And people people will feel it was a more weak choice if you don't stick with it. So stick by your guns, don't be afraid to make a choice, and don't be afraid to follow through on that and see where that takes you. So let's play some uh, basic games. Let's see, the, probably like six or seven people, maybe? They're, they're getting a little unwieldy beyond that. Uh, just, just come on up. Whoever's, whoever's first, and we'll, I'll pair off there. Uh, perfect, perfect, perfect. So why don't you face out towards the audience? In a line. There we go. And we're gonna play one word. Oh, sorry. Oh, uh, we're gonna play one word story. So basically, we're gonna get. Let's see. Let's see if we have an audience. Can we have them back up a little bit? Sure. Can you guys back up towards the table? Does anybody mind if I film all of this? I was no. gonna say. No, absolutely. Take the no, go for it. Well, that's, that's up to you guys. You guys feel uncomfortable? I mean, filmed in video game. Okay. Sure. So we're gonna play one word story. We're gonna get from our audience. Let's get a suggestion of a first word of a story. And the last word of the story. Once. Once? Okay, that's a good word to start with. <laughs> and what's the last word of the story? Burn. Burn. Okay. <laughs> the first word's gonna be once, the last word's gonna be burn, and let's have a title of a story that's never been written. Oh my blizzard. god, those flying toasters. What'd you say? Oh my god, those flying toasters. Okay, let's, let's <laughs> say the blizzard of the flying toasters. Um, so that's the name of the story that starts with once. So you, you would say once. once. And then you would add the next word of the story, and then the next word, and then go to you, and then once he says his word, then you'll go on, and then uh, once somebody gets to the word burn, it'll be over. <laughs> so we'll see what uh, what happens. So let's start once. Once. One. Uh. Lion. <laughs> uh, technical monster. Technical monster. Technically two words. <laughs> <laughs> Was. No. A. It doesn't have to make sense, just go. Just get the word. Hamster. There was a what? Hamster. Hamster? Bird? Bird? Is that what you said? Um, flu. Over? The Sahara. Desert. And? Eight. Three. Blind. 
<laughs> Sex. <laughs> Sadly, they copulated. <laughs> <laughs> Protection. <laughs> and? <laughs> Thereafter, <laughs> the children were confused <laughs> about everything. <laughs> Prodigious. Uh, snow <laughs> fell upon the mole. <laughs> the mole. The mole. It's hillier. Later, the uh, rising levels of sausage <laughs> covered everything. <laughs> Suddenly, toasters fell from the gondola, <laughs> which was unprecedented. <laughs> Fire that flew <laughs> past the toasters. And eight. Everything. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think that's good. That's good. Excellent. Round of applause, guys. Excellent. Excellent. Everybody, want to play one more story? Anybody got one more story? Okay. Sure. Okay. Uh, guys, if you want to, if you want to stay up, that's fine. We we'll probably need more people. We'll see you. Right. Sure. All right. Okay. Uh, so. Let's get another title of another story that's never been told. Anyone? The Sea Monkey's Apprentice. The Sea Monkey's Apprentice. <laughs> and what's the first word of the story? Scarface. Scarface is the first word of the story. And the last word? Alas. Alas. We're, we're, we're trying to get down to alas at some point. All right. So, um, so uh, sorry, what's the first word? Uh, yeah. Scarface. This was. Was. Standing. Beside a horse, <laughs> while eating pudding with scrimshaw, <laughs> while jogging <laughs> upon a horse, <laughs> <laughs> ponies, ponies. <laughs> Thinking this doesn't seem correct. To not think about it. It's, like, it's, it's like word association. It's like come up with a word right away. It doesn't have to make sense. It doesn't have to make a story, really. You know, just gotta keep it flowing. And, and you'd be amazed how much a story just comes out of it. You don't have to, you have to, uh, have to pre plan anything and suddenly it'll just be there. And that's where the really funny stuff usually comes up. Alright, uh, the next game. Uh, it's a game called the Martha Game. I have no idea how it got that name. Uh, I think it had to do with Martha Stewart. But, um, it's basically, uh, let's say, let's say six people. Six people. More. Anybody? Let's go. Six, two, three, four, five. One more person. Who wants to go up? Everybody just came in. Oh, we got six. 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 Okay, cool. All right. Let's say three people on the side and three people on the side. One of you in the lunch pot. Yeah. This would. Uh, oh, that's fine. That's seven's fine. Seven's fine. Um, so basically, what you're going to do is you're going to make a tableau. Um, based on a suggestion from the audience, this is, wouldn't be a performance game. This would be more like practice, something that you would do uh, in a warm up with a, with a, your troop or whatever. Um, you would come out and make a make a still picture, like uh, it's a, it's a suggestion for uh, uh, some sort of nature scene. Bowl of fruit. A bowl of fruit. Okay, so someone <laughs> would come out and. I'm no, 
Yes, yes, you come out and say, I'm a pair. Uh, you come out and say, I'm the table that the, that the uh, bowl is sitting on. They're like, uh, I'm a smiley place cat clock on the, on the wall behind it, you know. So until all of you are out there, and uh, we have our picture. So let's uh, get another suggestion, some sort of, let's say a, a place of work. Lab. A, a lab, okay. So just don't think about it as fast as possible. As soon as somebody's out, the next person goes. Baker. <laughs> <laughs> I am a Bunsen bird. Bunsen bird. I'm uh, one of the funny shaped ones. <laughs> <laughs> um, I am the thermometer. There we go. There's our lab, ladies and gentlemen. All right. Now, we, what you want to do is you want to stay, uh, stay back, like off the stage. Let's say, let's say the stage is this middle section. Uh, you know, you want to stay off to the side, like two lines, and and. Let somebody establish their item before the next person goes. So if one person runs out, and it's gonna be it's gonna be awkward. You're gonna you're gonna move, and somebody else is gonna move, and you have to decide without speaking who's gonna go first. Uh, so you know, one person comes out and they establish their thing, and then give them a half a second, then you come out and say, oh, I'm a trick. Yeah, you know, something like that. So let's uh, another suggestion. Let's say um, some place that you were on the ship today. Oh, shower. Shower. No, let's say uh, <laughs> state room. I am a folded towel. <laughs> I am a porthole. <laughs> I am a phone. <laughs> I'm a lamp. <laughs> All right. Uh, is everybody else want to play? Switch. Okay. Start. All right. Four, five. One more person. Okay. Six. All right. Let's uh, let's say something. Uh, some uh, scene outdoors somewhere. Campsite. A campsite. I'm a tent. Oh. <laughs> I'm a tree. I'm a campfire. Yay! Hey, I'm a marshmallow. <laughs> I'm a, a chair. I'm a bear. Hey! <laughs> All right. Uh, one more. Let's say um, some place that you visit on your way to work. Gas station. Gas station. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a car. I'm a driver. <laughs> I'm a trash can. <laughs> I'm, spit I'm spilt gasoline. <laughs> I'm a bucket of sand. <laughs> so you can see that that game is all about uh, making choices as fast as possible, not thinking about it. You just come up with the, your scenery, you come up with the objects that are around you, you come up with the, the, the backdrop, and, and that all defines who you are. I mean, why, you know, uh, where you are is always a decision of, of who you are. Just, you know, why did you end up in that place other than the fact that you need gas? I just, you know, um, that's the Nancy. The, oh, oh, let's see. Um, it's good. This game's called What Are You Doing? And everybody can play. You can just be sitting there and jump up at any point in time. Uh, we just need someone to come up and start the game. Let's say, who would like to come? You? Okay. This is called What Are You Doing? You basically you pick some sort of activity that is obvious that you can mine. It's like like charades. Okay. And at any point, somebody can say, uh, what are you doing? And you answer something completely different than what are you doing. <laughs> okay. Whatever you say, the next person has to do. Uh, okay. Yes. So you could be you could be washing a car, <clears throat> mm -hmm. and somebody says, "What are you doing?" And you say, "I'm cooking an omelet." And that person comes up and starts miming. Oh, it's burning. Oh, that's not good at all. So, so you would just pick an activity, and then the next person has to do exactly what you say. And then, then, then whenever somebody else says, "What are you doing?" Then that person will say something completely different from what they're actually doing. Okay. And uh, we just continue on from that. Okay. All right. 
the first person who, who names the activity, is there, once they name the activity to the second person, no, their, any, their thing is done, right? They say, yeah. Right, right. The person who's up there is done. That's yeah. what I thought. Yeah. Okay. Can you talk? So then just get down. Yeah, you just, once the next person comes up, you just go ahead and sit down. Okay. So at any point, someone can just say, what are you doing? And then we'll, uh, then you say something, whatever you want to say. Whatever, uh, whatever activity you would like to do. Okay. Pass on to the next person. All right. All right. What are you doing? I'm kicking a dog. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. What are you doing? Pouring a glass of water. What are you doing? Starting a fire. What are you doing? Grooming bunnies. <laughs> I want to give them a little bit more time to establish what they're doing. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm taming lions. <laughs> what are you doing? Eating an orange. Eating an orange. A spaceship. What are you doing? I'm oh, waiting in line. What <laughs> <laughs> are you doing? I'm selling old people. <laughs> Trying to find my stateroom while drunk in this turbulent sea. I'm trying to type the world's best novel. Yeah. 